What's up guys, Marcus here from Studio One Expert. And in this video, I wanted to take a look at a new feature that was added in 3.5. And it's something that I forgot to mention in my video. And I actually find it very useful. So in previous versions of Studio One, when you were working with the Arranger track, if you wanted to make any changes to the Arranger track, you had to use the trim handles at the edge of the Arranger sections over here in order to move them. So if I was laying something down, then I was adding my Arranger track. After the fact, if I wanted to make any adjustments, I had to use these handles here. Now in version 3.5, they've added a new shortcut, which gives us the ability to move these sections a lot more freely. And that is move Arranger sections only. And the way that we do this is simply by clicking and holding down, and then we can add the command and option on a Mac, or that would be uh, control and alt on a PC. And then as you move, the minute you move, you'll notice here we have move arranger section only. And now what we can do is we can move these sections, again, click and hold, then add your two modifiers and drag, and we can move these sections. And this works for sections together as well. So for instance, let's say that I wanted to, let's make an adjustment here. I can quickly move these sections over here all together if I wanted to. Again, selecting them, click, hold, add both modifiers, drag these over. And now the difference here is that if I tried to drag these over without the modifier, I'd be cutting and moving these sections. But when I can select these arranger sections over here, click and hold, add my two modifiers, I can now move them freely, just like this. Click, hold, two modifiers, drag this over, and then I can still edit them out and adjust the bounds of these selections by grabbing this tool over here, and I can adjust them without actually cutting the audio. But now, for instance, it's much easier to do a bit of a rough uh, arrangement or a bit of a production, and then start adding in your sections. You can quickly move them but with suspending the edits that happen on the actual audio files in your range track. So super useful feature, uh, in my opinion. And again, that is click and hold, add your two modifier keys, either option command on a Mac or alt control on a PC. And we can move the arranger sections only without adjusting the audio. Anyways, I hope you guys got something from this and we'll talk to you later. Cheers.